Schledwein said that solidarity tax would be used to redistribute wealth and reduce inequalities. Our first focus must be what do we do with our available funds for our own people. And I think the, the, the need to drive an development agenda where we give meaning to the policy of eradicating poverty in eroding inequalities and in growing the economy so that we create economic opportunity is the most important one. At the announcement of the national budget, the Minister of Finance announced that government will follow through in implementing solidarity tax, but only during the next financial year. Schledwein today said that principles in regard to the public's willingness and ability to pay have to be taken into consideration. There must be inbuilt the two important principles any tax policy must have. You must have regard for the ability to pay and you must have regard to the willingness to pay. If the tax burden is so concentrated on a specific group of taxpayers, then you water away or you erode away the willingness to pay and sometimes even the ability to pay. So that social contract that we have with any tax must have those principles in place. Solidarity tax is a government-imposed tax levied in an attempt to provide funding towards theoretically unifying projects. The tax acts in conjunction with income taxes on taxpayers, including individuals, sole proprietors and corporations. The solidarity tax is generally calculated based on a percentage of the tax bill.